The Dandelion Seed by Joseph Anthony, illustrated by Chris Arbo. It was autumn in the garden. All the flowers had died and dropped their seeds. Only one seed was left, a little dandelion seed, who was afraid to let go. But the winter began, wind began to blow. The stronger the wind blew, the tighter the seed hung on until it felt the wind blowing right through it. So think for a minute, why do you think the seed was afraid to let go? Think about how it might feel to be the only seed left. Then the seed left the garden behind. It became part of the wind and was carried away. The world was bigger than the seed had ever imagined. It was also more frightening. More lonely. The more the seed saw, the smaller it felt. Why do you think the seed felt small the more it saw? It wondered where it belonged. There's a little seed looking at a cow. The seed landed when snow began to fall. It listened in silence as peace covered it like a blanket. Remember the beautiful snow white flakes and they're all different. Look at that, a blanket of snow all over the land. Some seeds somewhere down there. How do you think the seed feels now? Do you think it feels anything? Finally, spring came. Sunshine warmed the air and the soil, and the little seed began to grow tiny leaves and roots. Its leaves spread wide to gather sunlight. Why do you think it needs sunlight? What do you remember about plants? And what is sunlight to plants? Its roots reach deep down to drink fresh rain. Soon the seed flowered into a, the bright, delicate dandelion it was meant to be. Does this remind you of any other story you've heard where something started out as one thing and then changed to something else? It shared its green leaves with deer and rabbits. Oh, why is it important that the bees and that moth and the butterflies are in the dandelion? It gave sweet nectar to bees and butterflies. So what is nectar? Do you know what nectar means? So nectar is usually something that you drink and it usually tastes pretty good. So I bet you those bees and butterflies really love that dandelion nectar. Then almost overnight, the life that began as one little dandelion seed ripened into many. They each became part of the wind and were carried away. And what's gonna happen to all those seeds now that are getting carried away. All except one.
Don't be afraid, whispered the dandelion. The wind and the sun and the rain will take care of you. Let go, you will see. You will see.